In this movie we're going to install VMware, the latest product of uh, VMware for Linux Mint. We are at the moment on a Mint machine 17.3 and a kernel of 4.0.23 and we are going to install this. So we go to VMware, to the products, we could have clicked already here, that's what we need. That's for Mac and this is for Windows and Linux. If we go here we can try it for free for a time and then we can test it if it's, it's suitable to your needs and you can buy it later on. So you have 64 bits for Windows and 64 bits for Linux. Let's download it. You will receive uh, program which is with an extension of dot bundle you will soon enough see what we can do with it let's go to the download already let's clean it up voilà. so here we have this program don't need this anymore and let's open a terminal and try to run it. As you can see, the tap completion cannot be done because of the fact that this is still a file. So properties, permissions, allow executing file as program. Now it's an executable. As of now, we can just complete it with tap. As you can see, v tap enter it of course it's an installation program so we have to give our uh, sudo or administrator password we should accept everything of course next we should accept again next would you like to check for product updates well no not for me would you like to help us no next enter the user that will initially connect okay it's going to be in the var library remember that a port and the license key optional ready to be installed and install it so why are we installing vmware installer vmware is a program where you can um, install embed a complete operating system inside of it so you can stay on linux mint and install windows 8 windows 10 inside vmware and run the programs or apps you need to run and still keep uh, working on linux the same applies for mac if you have uh, a mac you can install vmware fusion install this program and then install inside fusion any system any operating system being it's Linux, Windows or Mac. Why am I installing it also? We have now since a few days now a new version Linux Mint KDE. I don't know it's quickly let's quickly look for it we have to wait anyway. Linux Mint voila. Because next up I will be making an installation of this version. I would like, uh, I want to see what this looks like and without installing a complete hard disk and doing it inside VMware. So this concludes the movie. Everything is installed, installation successful. Let's quickly check VM and there you see everything you need to know. VMware workstation, the player and the virtual network editor those programs were added to your system. This concludes the movie, next movie KDE installation.